It was the dawn of the third age of mankind, ten years after the Earth Minbari War. The Babylon Project was a dream given form. Its goal, to prevent another war by creating a place where humans and aliens could work out their differences peacefully. It's a port of call, home away from home for diplomats, hustlers, entrepreneurs, and wanderers. Humans and aliens wrapped in 2,500,000 tons of spinning metal, all alone in the night. It can be a dangerous place, but it's our last best hope for peace. This is the story of the last of the Babylon stations. The year is 2258. The name of the place is Babylon 5. was our last best hope for peace. A self-contained world five miles long located in neutral territory. A place of commerce and diplomacy for a quarter of a million humans and aliens. A shining beacon in space, all alone in the night. It was the dawn of the third age of mankind, the year of the Great War came upon us all. This is the story of the last of the Babylon stations. The year is 2259. The name of the place is Babylon 5. The Babylon Project was our last best hope for peace. It failed. But in the year of the Shadow War, it became something greater. Our last best hope for victory. The year is 2260. The place, Babylon 5. Destruction. The year we took back what was ours. It was the year of rebirth. The year of great sadness. The year of pain. And a year of joy. It was a new age. It was the end of history. It was the year everything changed. The year is 2261. The place, Babylon 5.
Sinclair is being reassigned. Why don't you eliminate the entire non-home world? Why don't you go into reaching out of the stuff? Who are President Clark has signed a decree today declaring These Martin orders Lord. have forced us to declare independence from the So people get off their encounter-suited butts and do something. You are the one. We are the one. We are the one. We will die. Why are you here? Do you have anything worth living for? Think of my beautiful city. Giants in the playground. Get the hell out of our galaxy! We are here to place President Clark under arrest.